Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm very excited here to film this video because I've been waiting so long for this item to come in. Um, I'm talking about the Sonrev Aria belt bag. Now, this bag I think was on pre-order for a while. I actually went into a pop-up shop in a mall and I bought it in person. And at the time it was said that you pre-order and you'll get it the next month. So I bought it in August and it was supposed to ship sometime in September. Um, after I bought it, shortly after, uh, I didn't hear anything back and I just inquired and it turns out that they said it's actually going to be October and I'm like, okay, that's not good because I wanted to bring it to, on my Europe trip. And so they're like, we'll try to make it happen, but they sold out of everything they had, like a small quantity that they had. So a couple week, like I think a week before I was going to go to Europe, I confirmed with them it's not going to get shipped out. I was like, okay, well, it's fine. If it's going to ship out sometime in October, I'll come back to it. That's okay. And then I can bring it to my next trip in November. Uh, there was a pushback and they said they'll get it out by the end of October. So then I'm waiting, I'm waiting a week before I emailed again. And then they're saying, oh, it's almost here. We'll ship it out early in the week. Midweek, I emailed again. I feel I felt so bad. I was bugging them, but I really wanted it because, as you can imagine, I bought it back in August, and I was charged in August, and then I didn't get it in August, September, October, and I finally got it today. Now, they do require a signature and a person there, so it actually arrived yesterday, which is Friday, and I wasn't at home because I obviously worked, and so I had to go. Luckily, I was able to get it today from my post office. So. It took a long time to get this. Sorry about the long intro, but I am gonna unbox it with you. I've never seen this in person. I've only seen it online or whatever, but I have seen some of their bags in person. Their most famous one, most notable, is the Maestra. So I'll try to insert a photo here, but it comes in three sizes. It comes in the mini, the midi, which just most recently released, and then the, I guess, large or regular I don't know what you, if they had a name for it or size for it but yeah so it looks really nice the, the large is way too large for me if anything I'd probably do go for the midi or the mini but I don't know I, I I like the look of it but I don't know there's something about how deep the bag is how wide it's so when it's sitting against your body it looks like it juts too too far out for, for me because I'm pretty short so Anyway, this one is really nice, and let me just unbox it with you. Um, it comes in this box. It's just very, very subtle. There's duct tape on the side here, so very secure. Oh, and I guess I should show you the front, the front of the bag, or box. It looks like this, and I just gotta cut this out. There we go. All right. Oops. All right, so this was on the top right here, and that just fell out. And then that's what's inside, so let me just... Oh, this is really cool tissue paper. Look at that. It has Sonrev, and the, the octopus is their logo. That's really pretty. And little note card and a piece of paper. Uh, this is the receipt. And then this note card. Let's see. Oh, it's, it's a handwritten note. So it says, Emily, thank you so much for your order. We hope you really love your Aria belt bag and that it becomes your daily companion. All the best, Coral and Wendy. I actually met them, the both of them when they had the crazy rich asian showing i went to their event and i met both of them and they're both really really nice so that's a nice note all right now to the to the main part of this here is the bag with the dust bag right, let me put this box down so it comes with a dust bag with its name it's kind of got this satiny silky material and black ribbon. I like it when bags have this because it really helps protect the bag when not in use or when I'm traveling. So 
Here we are. It's got some fuzz stuck to it. Okay. Wow. Okay. It looks like they... Not sure why... The... I'm going to cut this off, but I'm not sure why that's there. So let me just reassemble the, the, the front of the bag. Just so that you can see what it looks like. It's really hard when this thing is right. Okay, so this is what it looks like. So if you remember what the Maestra looks like, this has a similar face kind of look. Now, it doesn't have the bulk on the side. So the Maestras are much thicker. They're meant to be sort of work bags, backpacks. So they could carry a lot. And so it, they're at least, I think, six, seven inches deep like I said it looked odd on me I feel like it looks too bulky and because I'm sure any any width at quickly adds I feel to <laughs> to my uh, you know going horizontal and I like I, I want to be more tall than wide so it didn't really work for me so I thought this has the same look as the Maestra and a much flatter kind of cut out and I think this will help look nicer against my body I'll try to insert some clips of me wearing it if I don't it'll definitely be on my Instagram like my outfits on my Instagram if you're interested I'll leave the information below and also here if you wanted to follow me to see how I style this but this bag I'm looking it over right now and it looks really really nice so it is a belt bag so this I don't know if I said it, is the Aria belt bag and I got it in the chestnut color and yeah it comes with this belt right here that you loop in the back as you can see and then there is a buckle that you can adjust so it looks like you you have holes up here but there are also holes all along the strap here so that you could put it around your waist or across the shoulder as a, like a sling or crossbody bag. There are no outside pockets so you can't you have to open the bag if you want to put anything in anywhere so as you can see and this is the front. It's a magnetic snap here. Some of the are sorry sorry some of the Maestra bags actually have a button snap rather than a magnetic snap so this one is the magnetic one and it it goes through here as you can see I can't do it on camera <laughs> there it is so right there and then just snaps back shut right like that and you open it by pushing or pulling it out and close it by that so magnetic lift this like this and then you get into the inside of the bag now I love the inside of the bag a lot of the, actually all the ones I've seen in person have this blue suede lining and it goes into the rest of the bag there is a zipper pocket right here oh and there's a chain Ooh, it's a heavy substantial chain this I'll get back to that so there's a pocket there and then it says Sanrev there, as you can see. And then, let me take this out. Don't be a rock star, be a legend. Care instructions. This project is made out is made out of genuine Italian leather and exquisite micro suede lining. Both materials are stain and water resistant. Resistant to dry or to clean. <laughs> Gently dab with a damp cloth. So I guess that's just the sales tag and then I want to show you on this side you can see that there are two slip pockets and it's this leather material which is the one that lines this one so as they've written this this bag has well this this one that I got is a pebbled leather they also have a smooth leather and a I think mimosa leather I believe that one's the toughest this one is kind of squishy but it's not as fragile as the smooth leather the smooth leather is like a buttery soft one and I felt that in person it's so luxurious but I was afraid that as a belt bag it's gonna rub against a lot of things and I was afraid I would damage it so this is like the best in between and yeah this one I'll bring it closer so you can see but it you can see the pebbling 
so it looks really nice has a good sheen to it it's squishy but not so that it loses its shape and the inside is pretty good I like that it is made of real suede micro suede and obviously leather because it it just makes it that much more luxurious and like they say it is stain and water resistant which is very important now this bag is even though it's leather and suede lined it doesn't feel that heavy so I'm, I'm actually quite surprised oh I forgot to mention in the front here there's a slip pocket right there and again it's also got that blue suede lining on this side right there so I'll leave the dimensions of this below because I don't have a ruler with me but I wanted to show you the, the chain I don't think the chain is comes with the bag anymore I think you have to double check with that if you pre-ordered before the end of October I believe I forgot what the, where the where the cutoff date was you you get this if you pre-ordered before that date and oh my gosh this chain now this chain I did not see in person because again I did not see the Aria bag in person but wow this is heavy this is heavier than a lot of the chains that come with my other bags it feels definitely substantial so let me just show you up close you can see that the chain is kind of this oh, I don't know the, the name of it but it's got these circular uh, hoops that come through and at the end you see the lobster class that gets adjusted through this area so these are much bigger um, holes for you to to basically put the lobster clasp and this goes through the back here where this is so you you wouldn't put this belt at the same time as the chain but you could put either or or none at all so if you had none then this will just be a clutch if you had this it could be a belt bag or a sling bag i don't know if i could wear it as a shoulder bag because if you if you see sorry let me so if you held it up it'll flip this way just because of how it's placed if you can see that but as a sling it'll rest against your body so it's fine like so if you had the chain then the chain let me just let me just qu quickly put the chain on here and take this strap off this is a long that's a very very long leather strap okay so I've looped the chain through the back as you can see that's where it is so it went through the same two tabs that the leather belt did and if I held it up now you can see it does the same flip thing but because the chain is, is flatter or not flatter it's it's less you can easily bend it so you can see you can bend it right there easier I, I feel like you should be able to wear it cross body a lot easier yeah I don't think you can see it I'm gonna have to insert photos of this but yeah you could do that you can wear yeah I think you could wear a cross body you can wear it on the shoulder I don't think you can wear it on your waist because I think it's too big but I, I'm gonna have to play around with it and 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 report back to you but I'm very excited because I'm gonna bring this to my upcoming trip and yeah it's I love that it's re well water resistant so even if it drizzles a little bit I wouldn't be totally afraid and if I take it out on a at night I wouldn't feel like I'm gonna easily dirty it I actually because of that benefit of it being stain and water resistant I actually went ahead and bought this also in the, in the ice color which is a really light blue color and so far I I really like the look of this and the feel of this I don't know how well it'll hold up but I am going to take it on vacation with me give it a try and report back later but so far I'm really glad it was worth the it was worth the wait I don't know if there's a, a long wait anymore I don't think it's on pre-order anymore I haven't checked today but you probably won't have to go through all the time that it took me which I think was the, was the more annoying part but if I just got if I ordered this and just got this I'd be so happy like I would be like over the moon about it because it looks really nice I really like it and I love the blue colored I don't know if I let me show you again this blue suede color is just so gorgeous yeah so anyway 
Oh, let me show you what I could put in there because um, that was one of my worries when I, I went in person. I wanted to see how big it was to see if it will fit everything. And I know they put the dimensions online, but it's always nice to see, you know, something in person and put your stuff in there. So I have my phone. This is the Pixel 2. And I'm just gonna put, slip that in there. And plenty of space, as you can see. Let me see if I could put it in the slip pocket, or sorry, the zipper pocket. In the back. Okay, so you could. So look, you see the zipper pocket? So the phone go, can go in there like that. I don't know if I'll do that because it seems like it's still a little bit snug so if anything I'll probably put my card holder or something more important in here and then the, my most used card probably like ID and one credit card here and then yeah so let me see if I have my phone in here I have a chapstick here I mean it looks like it could probably it definitely could fit a lot of stuff so it's it's not it's not small at all as you can see, I can probably fit a lot more stuff in there. Um, I don't really know what else I have. Because I could just, I'm, I'm just going to grab a few things. So I have a lotion here. And then I have a perfume. This is the Chanel Chance. In there. And so, as you can see fits quite well. The chapstick is, where'd it go? Oh, it's down here. Yeah, so you could fit a lot of stuff. I think as a, you know, day bag or going out bag, this one could definitely fit everything you need. Um, yeah. Okay, so that does it for my unboxing. I'm, again, very, very excited that I finally got it and even more happy that I'm, I got it before my next vacation so I can actually bring it. I am going to incorporate it with my outfits because I think this brown color, which that's why I got this brown color, would go with a lot of things. And yeah, I'm just very, very excited to start using it. So if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. I'll link this bag as well as all the other colors that it comes in. Um, well, I'll just link this bag, but then it'll go to the product page and then you can see a lot of other colors and materials that it comes in it also comes so this is the gold chain but the ice blue one that i purchased comes in a silver chain if i'm not mistaken i don't think there's a reason like why like you know one goes better with another so i will actually interchange mine for for usage but i think it's great that it comes with a detachable chain as well as a, um, a leather strap because you can use this as a belt <coughs> Me. So you can use the leather piece as a belt and you can use this as a chain on something else like you don't have to keep it on here You can interchange it. You can use it in another bag. I just think this is so versatile and I love versatile pieces Just because you know if I bring this I, I have a belt bag. I have a clutch. I have a crossbody. I have a sling bag, you know, I have a, like everything in this so yeah, I just love the versatility of one item because you can just you just get so much bang for your buck like I said I'll leave the dimensions below and the link to this bag below they also came out with a different belt bag and it looks more like a sunglass case shape so it's, it's hard to describe but I'll, I'll link that too if you're interested this one runs for what well, when I got it it runs for $345 which isn't terrible considering how much you get from it but I don't know if they've raised the price because I think that was another thing about pre-ordering that you get to keep the price at, at the current price but it might have gone up but I think it's well worth it even if it went up a little bit because of what you're getting so again I'll leave all the information below if you have any questions leave them in the comments and I'll try to answer them and um, if you want to see these with an outfit or how what it looks like on me go ahead and follow me on Instagram so that you can see it in person. If you ha if you liked this video, if you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up so that I know to do more videos like this. If you want to see follow up videos or other videos of reviews, unboxing, then hit subscribe and the little bell to get notified of any future videos. I hope this was helpful. I hope this was enjoyable, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.